Right, good morning everyone. This morning I'm just finishing off and then my sister can have this caravan. I've just added a little bit of a... Um, to match the runner, I've just added a little bit over the pillar. I'm not sure if you can see it. I've done an awful lot. Um, I've put a shelf, a double shelf. So let me just turn the caravan round. So you can see. So I've done a double shelf. I've added more lamps and bits and pieces, you know, things that hang. I do need to just go over that bit there. I added an electric light there because they have one just in case they can plug in. <laughs> Not real, you know. I... Uh, what else have I done? I put a sweeping brush in. And the inside, oh, and at the back, I've put a pair of guns on the wall with the uh, gunpowder pouch. I've got a picture or two to do, and which I'm going to do in a minute. On the front, I've added a little cushion with a rocking chair. Uh, there's a big mallet hammer, hammer there. Uh, I did paint the eggs, if you remember. I did bacon and egg and sausage in the pan. I've added the walking stick here. Just because you might want to have a walk. You'd have a dog and go for a walk. Uh, on the back of it, I'm going to put some dice on the arm. Um, some little dice. On the back, I've got the ladders to do. But on the back, I've made the box. Little hose pipe, some ladders, baskets and another lamp just in case. And then it's like a, what they carry everything in, in the box. I'm going to put a lock on that. Uh, what else have I got to do? Do the sides, which I'm going to do next, and then the wheels, and then this is more or less complete. But I'm just going to finish off doing the pictures. So, I've got three frames here. And I've printed three pictures off one that my sister chose, which is a black and white horse. She's chosen that one. I'm basically just cutting it. Bring this up a bit. Hopefully it'll fit. I can cut around it if not. Yeah, that's fine. That's going to be great, isn't it? Okay, so I'm going to glue that on. and Just let me trim that down a little bit. Let's make sure that fits. Yeah, I like that. That's going to look fab. So I'm going to glue this in. As quick as I can. Like that. I'm going to leave the frame black. That's nice. Nice picture. And I think uh, that can go up there. Yeah, we're going to put that up there. But I do have to get this on straight. Hopefully. Yeah, I think that's it. That's done. So we've got that picture in there. Now I chose another picture, which she'll laugh at. Because this is actually my grandson, Ethan, who does ride gypsy horses bareback. And there he is. That's my grandson, Ethan, riding a horse. And I wanted to put that one in this frame. So I'm just going to clean this one up a bit. It came off something. That's it. Yeah. <laughs> it's cute. 
<sighs> Let's have a look. It needs to go on like that, doesn't it? Yeah. Well, I'm just going to glue that on then. So this is his cousin riding a gypsy horse bareback. And he'll laugh at that, I would imagine. So just pop that on there. And then we're going to paint this up. I'm just going to clean this up a minute. There's a little bit on it. Look, he sits still. Yeah, we're just going to... And then we'll paint that black. Should have painted it first, but hey -ho, I'm not bad with a steady hand. <laughs> Good job, really. Or a straight line. I need a fine brush. Where's my fine brush? Let me get this out of the way so I need to put my hand down and do it. Sorry, I'm not sure if you can see what I'm doing. There, that will do. But yeah, <laughs> that's his cousin. Excuse me, Lucky, where are you going? So we'll just let that dry. And then I've got this frame with another picture of two Shire horses pulling a cart. Well, uh, well, they're doing something. I do have a photograph of Ethan and I when he was a baby. Well, well, when he was three. And I'm holding the reins of two massive Shire horses. And, uh, yeah, that'll do nicely there, won't it? Um, and he's smiling like mad, but he was a bit scared to start with. Right, let me just cut around that. Let me mark that out. Just putting a bit of glue on it. Oops, a daisy. Not quite, mate. Move it round. That's it. That's better. And I think what we'll do, we'll just pop that one. Oh, I haven't painted it. Bloody old woman. I can paint it while it's on, that's no problem. Yeah, I can paint that while it's on. And I think, I think if we can get this one dry, that one can sit just there in the background. Now, it is an arched wall. So hopefully, we've got that right. Yeah, that's fine. His cousin Ethan on a bear bang riding. <laughs> oh, I'm thrilled with it, me. So the inside's now completed, and now all I've got to do... Oh, I'll just get rid of that. I'm not messing about with any paper at the moment. Uh, is to let me fill that bit of a gap there that I've just seen. Yeah. Oh, I've got to varnish it all, haven't I? I'm going to rub over that in uh, silver. That one can stay as it is with their cousin, and that one can stay as it is as well. But I think for now, the inside of that is complete. Um... Yeah, I don't really want to put any more on there. I don't think. That chair looks a bit lost, doesn't it? What if we put a little doily on? Just hanging over. 
it just looks a bit lost so I'm going to put a little doily sat over the back well, that's it just looked a little bit lost so let me share, Ooh, share that with you Ugh. see now you can see it just it was too plain but hey they had lots of lace and stuff in these caravans um i'm going to do this side panel we're putting the filigree bit on that my sister's chosen this one and the wheels and then we're done and i can take it up to her today let me just, I've just spotted a little bit. Oh, I've got that to put in as well. Oh, hang on. I've just spotted a tiny wee bit that needs sorting. Uh, like that. Yeah, I'm quite thrilled with it. Quite thrilled, actually. I hope my sister is. It took a lot to do this one. This one was actually harder than the other one, in my opinion. I think, personally. But then I was doing it. <laughs> uh, I'm just going to, if that fits on there, it might fit without the lid. Just to fill that, yeah, that'll do, just to fill that gap up. Hang on, let me just touch that up because I don't... When I see a little bit of glue, I can't stand it. It does me head in. So I'd just like to make sure that it's... painted over. That'll do. Just filling that shelf up. And the other one was to put this little ornament on it as well. Which... Um, I'm going to put on the other side. Hang on. Don't be ringing me when I'm busy, whoever you are. Right, folks, what I've done now is I've just painted the first one of these uh, leafy things for my sister. See, like that. Because she wants that on the side of the caravan. So I'm just going to sit that up there. And I'm thankfully I had two. Well, that was lucky. Very lucky that I had two to work from. Um, taking out the bits that need doing. Quite awkward, some of them. Now, what I've got to do is match them up because I cut some of them, so put some of the things from them. That's the right way. So I've taken... this out. Had to look then. <laughs> We've taken that out. We've got that, 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 we've got that, that, and I've had to take that section out for it to fit on the caravan without it... Oops, don't lose them, because they'll come in handy somewhere else. Oh. Um, and then we've got this bottom section out here. So, let me just snip that properly. I mean, I can add a little bit in if I have to. Right. They're the same. And then I found two matching of these for the front of the caravan that I might put on yet. Mm. 
Yeah. I need them to go that way, don't I? So they look like that. We'll see. I might not do that yet, but we it, it's... They generally have some scrolls of some sort. Right, so I'm just going to move those bits out of the way.
Right, folks, what I'm doing now is um, my sister gave me these horses to sort out. This one came without a harness or anything. So I'm just adding in all the detail. Like I've put the blinkers on. I'm just putting the... Um, I'm not sure what they call it around the neck. Uh, I'm just copying this one. And it's coming together. I've done the bit around the neck bit there. And when it's all dried and in place, it will be fine. But um, I've never done anything like this before and I'm just going to do my best. It didn't have anything and it's going to have something. So it's better than nothing. That's how I look at it. I'm just gluing it in place so you know I mean by the time I've decorated it and everything it's got most of everything on it I'm just going to put the this on and then paint it and then what I've done is um, I've got I'm going to get some more out some more of these tiny uh, split pins let me just see yeah, get a couple more of these out. If I've got enough, yeah, I found some. I need about four. That's another one. One more. Hopefully, I've got enough. Yeah, I've got another one here. And I'm just gluing them on. It's just so that when I've painted it, it looks like it's supposed to look. So I'm just putting a little bit of glue on top of my lid. And then I can use this stick from here. So I'm just using that. Uh, and just placing these where the others are on the other horse. And then using the tweezers to grab these and poke them on. Into place. That's going to dry there all right. And then what I've got to do is to add... Now, what did I do with that? Some string. I need a bit of string. Let me just get some. Sorry about that. <laughs> it went out. So, um, I've done that. So, we've got them the same. There's one there and one there. And then all I've got to do is to paint it. So, I'm just going to send my sister a picture. Of what I've done. If I can get it right. Let me just smooth this out. Now I can paint it because I don't have to wait for this to dry. Oh, I've just put my, my hand in all that glue. Oh, silly Billy. So I'm just going to get a bit more paint. And I've just got to do the back bit as well. Sorry, I'm just shaping it. I'm absolutely blathered in paint, you know. We're just going to flatten that out a little bit more. Glue the back of it. And then pop that over the back of the horse like that. 
and we need one, two little bobbly bits.
Right, let me just find the right brush. Yeah. I do think my sister will love it. She loves the uh, caravan. I took that up earlier. But I've got the steps to do on it. We'll see. Now I've got the horse. And I put this little thing on that needs to be silver. But yeah. <laughs> that's just... You know, that's fine. I've got to do all the colourings and everything, which I'll do tomorrow. But yeah, I'm thrilled with that. Another one. <laughs> Very happy. By the way, folks, the doilies came in today. I've got uh, one big tablecloth, but the doilies have come in, so I have to do those this afternoon. And then uh, they'll be up for sale. And it's always grab them while you can. You know that. We sell them £20 a bag. And you get between 15 and 20, small, medium and large. Well worth the price with the price of doilies today. And um, you get some really nice ones. And many of them you can cut up. Well, that was the last lot and the, the lot before that. But many of them you can cut up uh, and do... Um, make more out of one, if you know what I mean. See, I'm just seeing, well, yeah, these will be fine. I'm thrilled with that. Well, to say it didn't have anything on it, it was completely just a bareback horse. That hasn't been too bad. That's it. Um, I will take a photograph when it's finished, but I've had enough and I'm finishing for the night. Thanks for watching. Take care. I'll speak to you all soon. Bye-bye for now.